Hi, thank you so much for joining me for Camp Week. This Terrmeister Terrific Tuesday will be about camp, sneaking in fitness. Now, this summer I worked at a local summer camp, and it's an overnighter. So we stay there every night. You spend days with children that um, work your nerves, with children you love, with children you're like, okay, I want, I haven't spent a lot of time with this kid, so let me get to know them. Um, and I would spend days with campers and try to keep fitness regimen because it's important to me to do so. But yet there came some times when I just wanted to sleep, um, when I just thought, you know what, I don't want to work out today. But let me give you some background right now. So wake up at about 7 a.m. Polar Bear Swim is at 7.30. Then 8 o'clock, it's over. We go back to the cabin until 8.30 when we have lunch or breakfast. To 9.30 to about 10, we do cabin cleanup. And then 10 to 12, they're two one-hour PlayStations. From then, um, from 12 to 12.45, we have pre-lunch. 12.45 to about 1.30, 1.20 is lunch 130 to about three is a siesta 320 to about 430 swim 445 to 550 or so second swim now our cabins only um swim once during once a day the only day that uh the only day that was an exception when we didn't do swim after siesta was on sunshine day when there was no swim but um and then pre-dinner uh was about six to six thirty or maybe five forty five to six. Evening program was about seven forty five to about nine. So snack at nine, bed by ten, then counselor snack around like ten thirty. So this is not a lot of time for fitness in between the busy schedule. So either I would have to um get up before the kids if I didn't have night duty that night, or I would have to go on siesta or some other time in, in the day. So there's not a line for not a lot of time for fitness in this busy schedule. So one session I was able to run a PlayStation that was fitness related and sneak fitness into the schedule. So I suggested that scheduling the fitness uh, session and leading it so that I could get a workout in. So um, I'm thinking this year what I want to do is I want to do like, you know, um, frog races or, you, you know, um, you, you know, bear crawl races or something where um, we can use fitness to actually achieve a goal, which I think would be great. Some kind of contest where we can do that or maybe like, you know, um, you know, globe jumps, you know, or, you know, frog hops somewhere. Either way, you know, we can both we can make it fun instead of just, OK, here's a workout. We're going to put the music on and you're going to die. Of course not. But um, I've been also thinking about putting, bringing my fellow counselors into it and being like, okay, look, we'll be this group for this session. You know, these are the days that we'll do, you know, um, that we'll do fitness in the morning and it's up to you to come. So, and um, I think that that would be a great thing. But there's another part with the nutrition that I'm definitely going to save for the next part of camp week. But I hope to, basically, no, I don't hope to, I'm going to, um, push fitness a little more during this during this uh, coming summer because of the fact that one I I already have a goal to return to camp and they won't believe their eyes. So see you later. Thank you so much for joining me for Terrormeister Terrific Tuesday. I'm going to talk continue on Camp Week and it's going to be called The Struggle Is Real. Thank you.